finds the, the tin of beeswax. Don't act like you never did something you needed to explain. He basically says, we're not that different. Don't pretend that you're better than me. I, and it's a scene where we really get to see that experience of what that felt like for Negan to walk into this room and see this young girl, the same age as Ginny, maybe, that the crowd has tortured to death and he doesn't even see what he's done. And it's really hard and painful for Negan to witness. And then we kind of come out in the present and we realize this isn't just a generic flashback. This is what's on Negan's mind. The closer we get to the girl out, it just starts to feel a bit too damn familiar. I know it maybe sounds odd to say, thinking of the fact that the Krat is probably older than Negan, but in some ways the Krat was his first child. He taught him how to bounce back from the tragedy of the loss of his family and how to survive in this threatening world. So excited to see Negan, and he kind of wants to show off this world that he's built, you know, in a kind of like, look, Dad, look what you showed me and look what I built. Because I have built a new world. The whole island will become our sanctuary. I think the most fun thing to watch you know, as a producer on set was when they threw Armstrong over the Oh man, that catwalk, that was scary. I have a terrible fear of heights and in pre-production, we went to go, you know, like scout the, the catwalk above the arena. Even before we were like out on the catwalk, I just started shaking and I couldn't move and I had to stop it. Thank you.